to town. Hi, my name is Emily Elizabeth, and this is Clifford, my big red dog. Clifford needed Emily, so she chose him for her own. And her love made Clifford grow so big that the Howards had to leave their home. Clifford's the best friend anyone can know. He's the greatest dog ever. I really think so. Clifford's so loyal. Clifford. He's there when you call. I love Clifford, the big red dog. So they packed up the family car. And the Howards left the city. They moved to Birdwell Island and their many new friends. There to greet Clifford and Emily. Clifford's so much fun, he's a friend to us all. I love Clifford, the big red dog. <laughs> New dog in town. I see it. Don't worry, I'll get it. Oh, hello. <laughs> Maybe we can talk more later. Girls can be so rude. I think I just scared him. Why would he be scared of you? Well, I can be a little loud sometimes. And you're not exactly the smallest dog in the park either. So, being big doesn't make you scary. I used to think it did. You're kidding. I thought Clifford was really scary. Before I got to know him, I remember the first time I saw him. He and Emily had just moved here, and they'd only been on Burwell Island for a few weeks. <laughs> okay, Clifford, we're here. I have to help Mom in the store, so you're gonna have to play by yourself for a while. We can play at the park later this afternoon, okay? What's going on? What's happening? Why aren't we moving? There's a tree! Ooh, ooh. Now just calm down, everyone. What happened? This old tree was knocked down in the heavy wind we had last night. We're gonna need something really big to move that thing. A big crane, or a big truck, or a big dog. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah. 
chase that new dog, Clifford. Looks like he wants to help us. <laughs> you think you can help us, big guy? Woof! That Clifford sure is helpful, isn't he? He sure is. <laughs> that dog was big, huge, humongous! There's a dog. Maybe he'll be my friend. I hope he likes to play tag. That dog doesn't like me. It really hurt my feelings when T-Bone ran away from me like that. <laughs> Way to go, T-Bone. I didn't mean to hurt his feelings. I just didn't want him near me. Why not? He was so big. But you didn't even know him. Tell what someone is like by the way they look. I know. That's why I'm glad I finally did get to know Clifford. Clifford? <gasps> oh, a pink one! Isn't it pretty? <laughs> I guess we better stop. That bag is full. Okay, one more. Whoa, whoa. There's some. No, 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 there's nothing here. This one is amazing! <gasps> oh! Ow! 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 Woof! 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 Ooh, that hurts. Silly old sand crab. <laughs> <laughs> What's he doing? Okay, Clifford. Thanks. Hmm. Wow. He's really gentle. Fun too. <laughs> yeah. 
you silly dog. <laughs> Clifford? Whoa! <laughs> oh, Clifford. You made me feel so much better. Wow! Clifford is a really great dog. I hope it's not too late to be his friend. Well, hello there. You're Sheriff Lewis's dog, aren't you? Why don't you come on over and meet Clifford? He's new in town, and he could use a friend. <laughs> Clifford sure loves making new friends. <laughs> You just can't tell what someone is like by the way they look. You have to get to know them. Then maybe it's time we got to know that guy. He's been listening to your whole story, T-Bone. Hello, Squirrel. My name's Clifford. Hey, he likes them. What's not to like? You never know who can be your friend until you take the time to know them. <laughs> 